isn't lust a demand of the body and mind why true self keeps connecting with love no sir this distinction is unfounded what we call as lust is not at all bodily or mental or physical it is a little deeper than that lust is if you see everybody so lustful if you see that lust consumes so much of one's time energy attention surely man is investing in lust because lust is not occasional lust is not periodic lust does not happen just once or twice lust is a constant happening and that constant happening surely cannot survive without man's active support surely one is allowing lust to happen rather surely one is promoting lust to happen why does man promote lust lust has no energy of its own one provides the energy of his own life of his own goals to lust the fire that lust has is the fire of the ego's loneliness the body is innocent the body knows no crime it is the ego that keeps on looking for the right thing at all the wrong places in fact that is the very definition of ego ego is the one who looks for the right thing but always at the wrong places when you look for satisfaction in material that is called lust that material could be anything that material could be towards material the passion that you see in a lustful being is a great flow of energy that flow of energy should have belonged to god instead it got distracted towards a male or a female body that is lust lust only tells you how much passion you have lust only tells you what all can you do when you are really helpent upon reaching your goals lust shows you how keen you are to meet your lover but you are meeting your lover in a totally wrong way in fact lust is a great revealer lust tells you that you are not at all indifferent or insipid lust tells you that you are not tepid there is a lot of fire inside you just that the fire is burning at the wrong place and is consuming all the wrong stuff if the same fire could turn inwards then it would burn down all that is false inside you 